Assalamu alaikum everyone. I hope you guys are doing well. So earlier this week, I announced that registrations to my online crash course is now open and they will remain open till the 31st of December. In this video, I am going to answer 10 of the most frequently asked questions that I get from you guys. I will leave timestamps in the description. So if you want to jump to a specific question, feel free to do that. So the first question, when do registration slash classes start and how to register? So like I said, registrations are underway and they will remain open till the 31st of December. Classes, however, are starting from the first week of January. To register, all you got to do is fill up the form, the link to which you will find in the description and it has the rest of the details. So that's it. Fill the form, pay the fees and you're enrolled. Now do remember, there are no registration charges and no such thing as admission fees. So the payment that you make will be for the month of January. So that means the next time that you're going to pay will be in the month of February. So keep that in mind. Question number two, how is crash course different from your regular batch? So again, a very common question. My regular batch started back in August and uh, since that batch gives us around like 10 months to prepare for the entire course. Obviously, it's a little more slow paced. We have more time, so we spend a lot more time on basics. This being a crash course, we have around about five months to prepare for the entire syllabus, which means this is going to be slightly more fast paced and we're not going to pay a lot of attention to the basics. We will, however, cover the entire syllabus. So yeah, that's how this batch, this crash course is different from the regular batch. Question number three, what subjects are being offered? So I'm teaching O level slash IGCSE math and and remember these crash course classes are only for students who have their Cambridge exams in May, June, 2024. So if you have your exam in May, June, 2025 or 2026, I will not recommend this crash course for you. Why? Because the syllabus is going to change. That is a topic for a separate video. So in order to be clear, I'll mention the syllabus codes also of the subjects that I'm teaching. 4024 for O-level math, 0580 for IGCSC math, 4037 for O-level ad maths and 0606 for IGCSC ad maths. Now, I'm not doing an AS or A-level crash course. I will, however, be doing a pass paper crash course, maybe in February or in March, but I'll keep you guys posted. So yeah, I hope that answers your question. I am an international student. Can I join? Yes, you can join from anywhere in the world. In fact, I get students from all around the world every year. So as long as you have an internet connection and you understand English, then that's it. You can join. Question number five, which is, will you be teaching specific topics or the entire syllabus? So a lot of times people think that because it's a crash course, course, maybe I'm only going to be focusing on a certain set of topics or maybe only the important topics. No, that's not the case. I will be teaching the entire syllabus. But as I mentioned earlier, because it's a crash course and we don't have a lot of time. So this is going to be a slightly fast paced course compared to the regular batch. What are the timings and how many classes in a week? So the timings are already mentioned in the form, but here they are on your screen as well. Now do keep in mind that these timings are not final. There will be extra classes and some classes will be extended. Why? You already know because this is a crash course. We don't have a lot of time. So we will do whatever that is necessary in order to speed things up. How long is this course? So these classes will go on till exams. Okay. There is no such thing as end date of this course. Why? Because close to the exams, we will be solving yearly past papers. And uh, in fact, we have classes a day before the exam, not because we have to complete the syllabus, but because generally if you're a student, you would know that, you know, a day before the exam, you generally want someone to like motivate you or like someone to maybe help you out with your confusions or generally really tell you like what stuff to watch out for, you know, what should you be paying more attention to? So like I said, there is no end date. The classes will go on till exams till whenever the last paper is. So yeah, I hope that answers your question. Will there be tests, homework, assignments, etc., etc.? Yes, of course, there will be tests, there will be homework. And uh, one thing that I should mention is that if you consistently fail to submit the homework and if you consistently fail to submit the test, in fact, for the test, there is absolutely no excuse. Okay, there is absolutely a zero tolerance policy. So homework, I understand sometimes you may have extra pressure from school or exams or mocks, whatever. But as far as tests are concerned, there is absolutely zero tolerance. If there's a test, you have to give it before the deadline. And if you fail to do that, I should give a disclaimer here. I'm afraid you will be asked to leave. So yeah, you know, it's important for you. If you're signing up for classes, if you're paying the extra fee, then you better make the most of it. And this is how you can make the most of it. So remember, there will be homework, which you have to complete and submit. 
and there will be tests which you have to give no excuses will recordings of the classes be provided yes all classes will be recorded and recordings will be shared with you why because as i mentioned earlier i get students from all around the world so because of different time zones it may be possible that when we're having a class you may be in school so for that reason the recordings will be shared with you they will be uploaded timely and uh, you will have access to them till the exam do i need to buy any books or material before joining no you don't need to buy anything at all in fact everything such as books notes past papers topical past papers yearly past papers will be shared with you all you need is an internet connection and a zoom id so if you have that that's all you need in order to join my class so that's it i hope i have answered your question as well if there's a question that i haven't answered then feel free to ask in the comment section and i will get back to you so that's it for this video i'll see you guys in the next one until then take care bye bye